Good morning, everyone. So today I need to be productive. I haven't filmed in like two weeks. Well, I tried filming like all week and just it didn't line up. Yeah, so today I'm going to run through really quick if you guys don't want to watch this video. I am, I need to send out some packages for eBay. I think I'm going to shut down my Depop and my Poshmark account just because I just have a lot more, I like, I have a higher success rate of selling like my old stuff on, I don't know why I look so fat. I have a higher success rate of like selling my stuff on eBay than Poshmark and Depop. Like, today I need to send out some packages and I need, today also needs to be a study day and I need to eat breakfast. I sort of ate breakfast, it's not, I can't really count as breakfast because it was an Oreo and some dried bananas. <laughs> so we might need to go get something else. I need to catch up on my Mandarin lessons <coughs> because because <coughs> mm, I've been slacking for the past like a week or so or maybe two weeks. I don't know. I also haven't worn my retainer in two weeks, so your girl might need to get braces again. Oh, I need to return something to Ross and probably there's a Bath and Body Works like across the street from it. So I might go there because I got this like free coupon for something. So I might as well just redeem it, you know. Okay, so we are ready and we are going to go. I was going to go to Tea House today to study, but I think I might just come back home and do it because I do have our, I already have lunch here. I got this like soy milk thing that I think I'm just going to try and yeah, I don't, I really want to go to Tea House, but like just like keeping in mind like <laughs> tapioca is like $4. And it adds up really fast, so I think that's also the reason why I don't get tapioca a lot. Um, I really only get it socially, so like, I like going to Tea House, but... Or I can't justify to myself, like, spending that $4 if it's not for something, like, useful. $4 can get you a lot of dye, so I'm not, like, joking. Um, where, what was my game plan? I, I had a game plan and I know what I'm supposed to do, but I'm not sure how I want to go about it. Okay, so I just got out of the post office. Um, then I have the receipt from the post office because I sent out my stuff. Um, if anyone is watching and wants to buy any of the clothes that I show, if, I guess if you're following on my social media, you'll see. Um, I think what I'm going to do is put up like, like at the end of my videos now. I guess I'll just put up like a, a screen thingy of like all the stuff that I'm selling. So I may, should I do like five or ten every um, every like video, and then like um, I think you guys can like direct message me or like comment. But if you guys want to get it, like just message me, and I'll send it. Like we'll figure this out because like I'm really tired of having all this stuff, and so. Um, yeah that's going on okay i think i'm getting better at this post office thing this is like the third time i've been and this is like without ryan and it's really weird because everyone thinks i should be in school but that's okay um we're gonna go home now i had this thing with me and i kind of want to refrigerate because like it doesn't need to be refrigerated but i kind of want to and yeah i honestly don't know if it's good because i got it on sale and it was like 50 cents um and it like it says best by january 22nd so we're gonna be dangerous today guys okay so i actually do have something i would like to talk to everyone about i was gonna make an entire video about this but i felt like it's just oh my goodness what is this angle it's just like it's not there's not enough to like make a whole video about it um but there's enough to like put it in a video you get it so i had this nightmare a few like maybe like a week ago like i want to say a few days ago but i know it's been longer than that so um i want to say a, like a week ago then and this isn't like the first time i've had this nightmare it's actually the sec second or third time i've had it and i actually had it again a couple days ago and it really freaked me out and I feel like I need to tell people about it. So, and just like a forewarning, like this is, nightmares for me are very common. So like, there's nothing like, I guess wrong with me. If, it, if anyone's worried, I guess 
most people wouldn't be. They're just like watching my videos, but like I get nightmares pretty frequently. It's it's I get nightmares much like way more than I get dreams. So uh yeah, so it's like pretty normal for me to get nightmares. So it's not like something weird. But anyways, so in my nightmare I was oh okay, red light. I was with Caitlin and we were in New Orleans, right? And for some reason we had gone we now that I'm dry like we had gone to the supermarket by ourselves, I think, and we were just, you know, getting stuff and for some reason, we were, like, not taking a back way, but I guess in a secluded area of the store. And I noticed that these two guys were following us. And it, like, freaked me out. And I was like, Caitlin, when we get past the door, we need to run away. And I guess, like, we were, like, I don't know why we were going to the back of the store, but we went through, like, a back exit. And they caught up to us and then hit us over the head I remember and I like in my dream I remember like um Caitlin and I were like tied up or something and this part's a little f this is why I was I was gonna do the video like right after I had it but I was like so shaken I I think I'd come to and I had like convinced them to let me go to like do something otherwise people would be like looking for us you know and so I had gone back to my grandparents' house and I told, I was like, you guys, you guys, like, Kate and I are about to get kidnapped or whatever. And, and I was like getting a search like thing together. I, don't, I have no idea. It was so strange. Like we were about to get kidnapped and my dream kidnappers let me go. I don't know. Um, but yeah. And then suddenly I like walked, I'm like telling everyone, I'm like, we're calling the police. We're getting everything ready. And Caitlin walks in the kitchen and I'm like what and she's like I don't know they just let me go and but honestly it was like it was really scary because in my dream I guess I had acknowledged that I had another dream or like you know nightmare like this but in my nightmare it didn't register as another like nightmare it registered as an actual event that had already happened so this would be like the second kidnapping or like abduction of me and Caitlin, like because it happened the last time too and so I was just so freaked out I didn't know what to do I was like this can't be happening again <laughs> and yeah so that happened and I, I woke up and I was like crying it was like 4 35 in the morning and I couldn't go back to sleep yeah. so that did happen in my nightmare um my nightmares actually consist of me losing like my loved ones and like my family a lot. I don't know why, but it's like pretty normal for me. It's, like to I don't know what it is, but like loss and death are like like common factors in any like dream or nightmare that I have. I and again, I really don't have dreams. I really can't remember any dreams that I've had. All right, I am home now. It is dark. It looks like it's gonna rain, but I've got my goodies. I've got my, what is this called? Pearl Organic Soy Milk. Do you see that? It is <laughs> the 31st, and this says Best Buy January 22nd. But that's okay. Um, I think I'm going to go change because I'm going to have dumplings for lunch. Um, what's my call it? And the soy sauce might get on my white shirt, so let's not do that. But isn't my fit cute? I like it. I'll put some pictures up. I took some pics earlier when the sun was out and it was really cute. But it's really cold in my house. It's like colder in here than outside. Okay. Okay, you guys. So I know that this jacket, like, looks ridiculous. So, like, I... You guys see me wear this all the time, but actually it's so warm. Like, it's warmer than a lot of the sweaters that I have, so it's really convenient. Let's go eat. I can't find the soy sauce, and that is a problem because I'm eating dumplings. Okay, you guys, I found it, 
and all is well. Let's eat. So I ate my dumplings like super, super fast because I was really hungry. So I'm debating eating something else, but I'm trying to keep my weight down right now because uh, Reese, if anyone doesn't know, my grandfather uh, recently passed away. And so while we were in New Orleans, um, we, it was just really hectic and it was a lot of chaos. And so the cousins and every, like a lot of time was spent in the hospital and a lot of time was, um, you know, just spent running around like doing things. And so we ate a lot of junk food and I mean, that's, I want to say the first time, like when my entire family went to New Orleans, it was like December 23rd or something. And I spent almost a week and a half there the first time and then three or four days the second trip and that's all within like the past month and in the past month i've consumed probably a year's worth of junk food that i would normally eat because my family doesn't have junk food in our house like i don't we just don't eat it and like unless it's like in front of us we'll eat it but usually we are pretty healthy and so i want to say like in the past month i probably consumed a year's worth of junk food that i would normally eat so my weight did go up again i had hit 91 finally <laughs> after so long but then after um you know everything with my family it went back up and i think i'm at like 95 or 96 right now so i am trying to keep my weight down and to everyone who thinks i am already skinny thank you so much i just want to be um just a little smaller just because i guess like no one actually sees it but i see it every day just because like i can tell like around my waist area you can't see it um obviously uh but around my waist area i do fill out a little bit and my stomach gets um a little smushier <laughs> and i don't really like it. it just i don't like it so i have to start um probably exercising again soon and yeah but we are going to try this pearl organic soy milk because it cost me 50 cents and okay wait um do i shake this or something i guess should i shake it just in case will that mess it up i'll just shake it i'll just shake it a little bit i'm sure it'll be fine what if it tastes really bad you guys like what if because it says best by january 22nd do you think it's on sale because it's not supposed to be good? Like, because it ex best by January 22nd? And it says refrigerate after opening. So, like, you know how, like, with canned goods, you say, like, refrigerate after opening? I think that's what it means. Like, you don't finish it. But, like, as long as you don't open it, it should be fine. It's, like... It almost tastes like chocolate milk, but that's not quite it. It's like chocolate milk diluted. Diluted chocolate milk is what it is. I also redeemed this like free gift from Bath & Body Works. If anyone wants to get me anything for my birthday, <coughs> March 29th. Um, my favorite thing from Bath & My favorite scent from Bath & Body Works is Japanese cherry blossom. And I got a... Um, moisturizer. It's oh my goodness. I don't think it was that as well. Okay, if you see, you guys see that bump. I thought I would be okay, but I guess I'm not. Okay, I can't drink the soy milk anymore. Because I'm allergic to soy milk. I thought it would be okay. Obviously, those of you who know me, I am allergic to everything. And I thought it would be okay, but... Oh no. Okay. So I can't eat it. Great. I really love soy milk, so that's such a bummer. But, you know, sometimes life just doesn't want you to die, even if you want to. Uh, <laughs> um, okay, I guess I'll just put it in the fridge and drink it later or something. Once I calm down a bit. Because I think it was because I drank it so fast. I think I drank, like, I think I drank, like, half of it in, like, that, like, 20 seconds or so. So I just need to calm down a bit. And I should be fine. It is currently 2.39 in the morning. And I'm so hungry. I don't even know what I'm doing up. But I 
I got into an argument with my mom earlier, like sort of an argument, not really, I don't know, but I got upset, and I just was like, you know what, I'm just gonna 